You. Well, unwelcome to Sesame Street. But this is my kind of morning. Yeah. There's no one around my trash can. <laughs> Hi! Uh, listen, you can't just uh, appear like that by somebody's trash can there, fairy wings. Who do you think you are? Well, I'm Abby. And my mommy's a fairy godmother, and we just moved here today, and now I'm looking for someone to play with. Hey, come now, coming right down, quiet. Well, I'm sorry, Miss Fairy Tale, but I've got to go feed my animals. I'm coming. Hey, uh, if you see Hansel and Gretel, tell them to get lost. <laughs> Getting sorry we moved here. <sighs> oh, I miss my old friends, the elves. My mommy says you'll meet new friends on Sesame Street. Well, where are they? Well, I guess I'll play all alone, unless I bump into someone nice. <laughs> oh. I'm a snuffle up a guess. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> but you're a giant. No, just an eight foot bird. See, I have wings. Hey, so do you. Mm hmm. I'm a fairy godchild. A fairy godchild? Wow. <laughs> My name is Abby. Abby Kadabby. <laughs> Will you play with me? Or should I get lost? Oh, no, 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 no. don't get lost. No, get found. <laughs> we'll play with you. Actually, there's a big game of hide and seek going on over near Hooper's store. Oh, right, you yeah. can come with us. Sure, come on, and you'll meet everybody. <laughs> everybody? Uh huh. Um. What? Um, uh, Abby. Abby, where'd you go? Uh, Abby. Abby. Abby? Uh, I changed my mind. Um, I'll play alone for a while. Oh, I'm not ready to meet everybody. Oh, come on down, Abby. Yeah, don't be shy. You don't have to be afraid. They're just new friends. Yeah, you can't always play alone. Yeah. Everyone needs someone to play with. Everyone needs a friend. Someone to dance and sing with. Someone to share a swing with. Someone to feel it spring with. Everyone needs a friend. Everyone needs someone to play with. Someone to be her pal. Someone to rhyme a rhyme with. Someone to share a dime with. Someone to spend some time with. Everyone needs a friend. They can be big, they can be small. They can be short or tall. Someone I'm always glad to see. Someone I like and who likes me. You need someone to play with, someone who's tried and true. It's lucky that you do, cause we need someone to play with too. You! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but suppose your friends don't like me. Oh, they will. We like you, <laughs> and we just met you. You do? Oh, yes, it could even be love. <laughs> Hello. I'm ready. Okay, well, 
So, do you know how to play hide and seek? Well, I know my name and I know my magic trick. But someday I hope to know everything. Ah, oh, me too. <laughs> my mommy says I've got a lot to learn. <laughs> well, you moved to the right street. Oh, yeah. Hey, gang, we got someone new here for you to play with. Buddy, this is Abby. She just moved here. She's a fairy godchild. Wow. Oh. Well, hi, I'm Zoe. I'm Steven. I'm a Gemma. Oh. Hi. I've never met a fairy godchild before. Mm -mm. Can Elmo look at Abby's wing? Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, let's see. Oh. Whoa, wow, they're <laughs> Thank you. Someday I'll fly. Wow. Well, well, do you want to play hide and seek? Well, teach me? Oh, oh sure. you know, it's easy, Abby. Mm -hmm. Zoe will count to ten, mm -hmm. and then we'll all run and hide. And then Zoe comes and looks for us. Yeah. yeah. Hide so Zoe can't see Abby. Hide so Zoe can't see me. Hide so Zoe can't see me. Okay. Okay? Yeah. Ready, everybody? Yeah! yeah. Ready, ready. All right. Get set. Uh -huh. Oh, come on, Steven. <laughs> Where are they going? Oh, over here. I'll go. Two, three, four, five, six. Where do you hide in this place? Seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, 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 oh. I spy Snuffy and Big Bird behind. Oh. Oh. How does she know we were here, Bird? I don't know. Ollie, Ollie, and Bray. Oh. <laughs> well, hey, wait a minute. Where's Abby? Oh, yeah. Abby? 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 Abby. 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 Oh. Oh, there you are. Wow, that was so magic. <laughs> you disappeared. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah Abby. There's no disappearing in hide and see. Oh. Mm -mm. Yeah, but nobody told her not to disappear. That's I'd true. disappear if I could. <laughs> <laughs> Did I play wrong? No, 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 no. Abby. Now, for the first time, hide and seek, you were great, Abby. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now we'll teach Abby how to be us. Oh, yeah. Good. Okay, Abby. Mm -hmm. See, you cover your eyes okay. like this, uh -huh. and then you count to ten, mm -hmm. and then <laughs> Cover my eyes and count to ten. Well, how do you count to ten? I, I don't know how. Oh, lucky I was passing by. And I, the count, professor of counting to ten at MIT, the Moldavian Institute of Technology, will teach you how. Okay. One. One. Two. Two. Three. Three. Four. Four. Five. Five. Six. Six. Seven. Seven. Eight. Eight. Nine. Nine. Ten. Ten. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. It's so enchanting. <laughs> I counted to ten. I counted to ten. <laughs> oh, you'll never forget the first time. Oh, again. Oh, my pleasure. Okay. One, One two. two. Three, four, five, six, seven. Abby, 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 you're supposed to look for us. After she counts to ten. Eight, nine, ten. Ah, ah, ah. Easy with that one. Uh-oh. A tad too much lightning. My trainee wand is broken. Oh. Now I can't do my magic trick. Oh, don't worry, Abby. We'll just take it to the fix-it shop. <laughs> you go ahead, Bird. I'm supposed to wait here for my mommy. Oh, okay. Oh, come on, Abby. I'll take you to the fix-it shop. Well, what's a fix-it shop? Oh, well, it's a place where they fix things, like toasters, 
and magic wands. <laughs> Come on. Bye, Abby. Let's go. Is there an optician in the house? What well, I think this is a tuppy. I think that we have to wait. Oh, this hi, is Abby. Hi, Big Bird. She's a fairy godchild. Mm -hmm. Hi. Well, hello, Abby. I like your wings. Yeah. Nice wand, too. What happened to it? Well, she broke it. That's why we came to you. Yeah, it's very serious. It's my training wand, and now I can't do my magic trick. Oh, well, that's all right. You don't have to feel bad no. about that. You know what? We can fix it. Yeah, here. Let me see it. You can? Be right back. We have some very fast glue. How did you break it? Well, she was learning to count to ten. Mm -hmm. She wants to know everything. <laughs> uh, here you go. How's that? Oh, huh? It's fixed! Wow, that's our fix-it shop. <laughs> oh, well, it's magic! Uh, no, it's glue. <laughs> well, why don't you check it out? See if it works. Try a magic trick. Yeah, my magic trick. <laughs> um, what is your magic trick? I turn things into pumpkins. Oh, mm -hmm. well, gee, Abby, I, um... Lumpkin, bumpkin, diddle diddle, dumpkin, dumpkin, frumpkin, pumpkin! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> well, it worked. Yeah, it worked too, you know. Oh. The wand is all fixed. <laughs> Very nice, Abby. Yeah. Uh, now, could you please turn the pumpkin back into a toaster? Um, I can't. Why not? Well, it's not my trick. Uh oh. That was Mrs. Moskowitz's toaster. She can't make toast in a pumpkin. Well, I'll call my mommy. She'll know how to change it back. I hope so. It's my mommy's answering machine. She's having tea with Rumpelstiltskin. Mm -hmm. Oh, mommy, I turned the toaster into a pumpkin, and I need help. Ah. She'll call back. I hope so. Abby, oh, yeah, Abby. Abby. Abby! Oh, she's still here! Yeah, yeah, well, you ask her. Okay, okay. come on. Abby, come on. Come okay. on. Mommy. Oh, she says you're welcome. Mm -hmm. I'll be right home, Mommy. Okay. And Mommy, I'm glad we moved to Sesame Street. <laughs> she says to walk home, not fly. Oh. We're good. just around the corner, and oh. it's healthy to walk. Yeah, great. Good. Bye. Bye-bye, Abby. Bye, Abby. Hey, Abby, Bye. I'll walk with Bye, you. Bird. Bye. Good. Bye, Big Bird. Hey, Abby, mm -hmm. do your wings ever itch? Yeah. Sometimes oh. I just scratch them with my wand. Oh. Huh. I'll have to get a wand. Mm-hmm. It's yours.
just said D flat. What's he doing playing D sharp? Uh, hey, Hoops, you're looking kind of down in the feathers, man. Hey, what's up, John? Boy, it's just one of those days. Where you're trying to have a jam session, and just nothing seems to go right. I guess this bird's feeling a little blue. Oh, yeah, I I've been there. You know, you know how I cheer myself up? I sing a song. Oh, you're going to sing one right now? It'll make you feel good. All right. Sing a song about sunshine. Sing a song about taking the walk in the rain. Uh -huh. Sing a song about daytime. Why not sing about taking a ride on the train? Uh, yeah, yeah. You can't go wrong when you sing a song. You can say that again. <laughs> Singing loud, singing strong. It feels good when you sing a song. You're on hoops. Sing a song about new friends. Sing about tomorrow and yesterday. Sing a song about old friends. Why not sing about having a sax to play? It can't be bad, even if it's sad. Sing it loud, sing it strong. It feels good when you sing a song. All right. Let's sing a song about pickles or plants, <laughs> or birds or ants, yeah. or anything that comes along. Sing a song about laughing or crying, a banana or a line. Sing a song about the short and the tall, the big and the small, or, or anything, anything at all. Sing, sing a song about movies. Yeah. Sing a song about something that's in your head. Sing a song about daydreams. Sing a song about orange, yellow, blue, or red. You never lose. Sing it fast, sing it slow. It feels good when you sing a song. Here we go. You can't go wrong when you sing a song. Oh, sing it high, sing it low. Sing it fast, sing it slow. Sing it happy, sing it sad. Sing it good, sing it fast. Sing it all day long. Yeah. It feels good when you sing a song. Oh, yeah. 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 Woo -hoo -hoo. Boy, you got away with those ivories, my man. Thanks, Hoots. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> dawn, dawn, dawn. Hello. Prairie Dawn here with the letter of the day. And today's letter is the letter M. <gasps> cookie! Oh, wait, 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 cookie monster! No, 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 cookie, cookie, cookie! You cannot eat the letter of the day. That not letter of the day. That cookie. No, 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 yeah, yeah. Cookie, cookie, cookie. This is not a cookie. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hear me, hear me. It doesn't even look like a cookie. Look, look, look. See? It doesn't look like a cookie. Hey, that not cookie. No. What that? That um. That letter M. That's right. It yeah. is. It is the letter yeah. M. And you know what? what? It starts words like milk and monster and magic, just to name a few. Oh, uh, Prairie did not. Did you say mmm? Yes, yes, I said mm, milk and mm, monster right. and mm, magic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, but you did say mmm, right? You're driving at, but yes, I did say, mmm. Yeah, well, uh, you know that, uh, mmm, that also sound that me make when me eat cookie. What? Oh, yeah, yeah. No, oh, no, that no, makes me so hungry. No, oh, yeah. cookie, we need yeah. to learn oh, yeah. oh, I was just oh. to this is very educational. Excuse me. Hey, all you M fans, this one's for you. You take a line, add two mountains. You got an M. That's an M. That's a small letter M. Now make a line, add two mountains. You got an M. That's an M. That's a lowercase M. Mass momentum, shake it loose. Sing with the mermaid and the moose. M.
In the alphabet system, there are 26 letters. The detectives who investigate these ABCs are members of an elite squad called the Special Letters Unit. These are their stories. Okay, gather around, everybody, gather around here. What is it, Captain? All right, we got a missing letter, and it looks like this. I know that letter. Yeah, 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 me too, Captain. Yeah, I've seen it before. M. It's the letter M. Yeah. Right. Yeah. M. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good, M. good, good. That's right. Now go out there and find that M. Right. Okay, right. Captain. Okay, got it. Today! I found the missing M. Where is it? Where is it? Right here. This doesn't look anything like the letter M. Oh, yeah? Well, listen to this. <coughs> See that? Moo starts with the letter M. So this must be the letter M. Maloney, this isn't the letter M. It's a cow. It is. You can go now, Bessie. The name's Murray. All right, come on. Quack. Come on. Quack. Come on. Quack. Come on. Quack. Hey, Captain. Uh, where, look at where, this. What? I found the letter M. Where? Where? Right here. This isn't the letter M. It's a duck. But not just any duck. I am a mallard. Mm hmm. That's right. And mallard starts with the letter M. Well, that may be, Munch, but it still isn't an M. It doesn't look anything like an M. Eh, see, that's what I tried to tell him, but who listens to a talking piece of poultry? He's asleep. Yeah, yeah, well, you better wake him up. I ain't gonna wake him, you wake him. No way. Hey, I know. What? Can you do that chung chung thing again? Uh, uh, where is that missing letter M? Huh? Sorry, Captain. Mm. We looked everywhere, but no luck. Yeah, we just yeah. couldn't find the missing M. Yeah. Uh, excuse me, uh, could you tell me which way to the men's room? Sure, uh, down the hallway to the left. Hey, wait a minute. Hmm? Hold her right there. What? Uh, what I do? You're the missing M. Oh. No, I'm not. Sure you are. You look exactly like the missing M. See? Yeah, but I got a mustache. See? Yeah, that's true. true. Yeah, 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 you got a yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Mercy. Oh, <laughs> it's, it's the letter M. All right. All right. I confess. I am the letter M. We did it. We found the missing M. Right. All in a day's work for Law and Order Special Letters Unit. You know that uh, that chung chung thing can really get on one's nerves. <laughs> okay, enough chung chunging already. <laughs> Mommy, no, make it stop, please. Carol and Christopher like to eat a snack before they go out to play. Today, Christopher has a banana. Looks like Carolyn is eating cake. It's a good thing they had a little something to eat. It looks like they're planning to do some serious playing. Hmm, what's wrong with Carolyn? She doesn't seem to have the energy to keep going. Christopher is still going strong. Why do you think she got tired so fast? She had cake. He had a banana. Maybe that cake wasn't the best thing to eat when she wanted energy that would last as long as she wanted to play. Hello again. It's another day. Looks like they both have bananas. Carolyn is going to have all the energy she needs. Yup. I do think that banana was a better thing for her to eat. Yup. Now it's time for a healthy storybook moment. The story of Sleeping Beauty. Sleeping Beauty liked to rest, so she'd feel healthy at her best. Mm, excuse me, you're not resting. You're dancing. <gasps> you noticed. <laughs> but 
You're supposed to be resting so you can stay healthy. Well, dancing is great exercise, too, and keeps you healthy, too, you know. <laughs> That's true, but this is the story of Sleeping Beauty. Well, right now, I am Leaping Beauty. <gasps> ah! Leaping Beauty loved dance. She did it whenever she got the chance. She'd twirl around <gasps> and sway and leap. Oh! And when she was done, that is when she'd sleep. <gasps> oh, now you're going to rest? Sure. All that exercise has made me pooped. <laughs> I need my sleeping beauty sleep. Ya yum here. Cha cha ming. Cha cha cha. Cha cha ming. Oh, you're not familiar. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> Beauty, your prince Cha Cha Charming is here and ready to dance. <laughs> Beauty, hello, Cha Cha Cha. <sighs> oh well, <gasps> maybe a Cinderella is home. Ha! Cha Cha Cha, Cha Charming. The end. Susie Kabloozy. Guess what? My cat theft is sleeping! <laughs> Every kitty sleeps. Every kitty sleeps. Every night or afternoon. Or when the morning creeps. Persian cats on tabletops. And Siamese cats, they peep. <laughs> they like to sleep. How do we know? So, shh, every kitty, every kitty sleeps. There are kitties who sleep softly, and some who sleep out loud. There are kitties who sleep alone, and some sleep in a crowd. There are kitties who nap quickly. There are kitties who sleep for days. But it really doesn't matter, don't you know? It's so cause they can sleep in oh so many ways. <laughs> Every kitty sleeps. Every kitty sleeps. Every night or afternoon when the morning creeps. Silly cats who snore a lot or fluffy cats that weep. They like to sleep. How do we know? Every kitty sleeps. Every kitty. Every kitty. Seth, I was sleeping. Come on, get up. It's time to play. Guess what? Zebras do trot around and follow through. The zebra is really stripy. Sea lions don't have hands and feet. We use our flippers now. Keep the beat. Is that a sea lion? Flamingos flap their wings to fly. Flap your arms, give it a try. That flamingo is really pink. I'm a kangaroo in space. Jump up high, but keep your place. Jump, 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 jump. What's that kangaroo doing here? <laughs> jump in the air. <laughs> jump in space. <laughs> oh, hello there. 
it is I, your furry pal Grover, and I am just come back from Iceland. Yeah, that is a country that is just a hop, skip, and a really long cab ride away from Sesame Street. Yeah, but it was worth the trip because I have brought something very cute all the way back from Iceland. And it's right here in this box you want to see. Yeah. What? It is empty? Oh, oh no, it is empty. Oh, I am so embarrassed. Well, watch this and you will see what they thought that was bringing you back from Iceland. Roll it! Hello, and my name's Arna. I live in a town called Heimae on the Western Islands. It's a part of Iceland. Puffins are funny birds with orange beaks. Aren't they cute? Every summer, and my family and I help baby puffins after they're born. It's a tradition here in Heimae. And my family are looking for some that need help. When the babies first try to fly, sometimes they fall to the ground. We found one. The puffins get lost at night. They are confused by the village lights and fly into town instead of out to sea. <laughs> Here's my brother Finboy and my brother Olaver. Look, they found a puffin. We take the puffins home for the night so nothing happened to them. We make sure they're okay until the morning. In the morning, when the sun comes up, we take them to the shore. <laughs> and let them see the ocean. We throw them in the air, and they take off out to sea, where they will be safe and live now. Goodbye, Pufflings. Oh, the little Pufflings are so cute, are they not? Oh, I wish I had one to show you right now. Oh, what is that? You really want to see a Puffling? Oh, wait a minute. I have an idea. Do not move. I mean it. Ta-da! A Puffling! Chirp, 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 chirp. Am I not adorable? Chirp, 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 chirp. Oh, look chirp. a puffling. Oh, he looks confused. Oh, Let's help him. Uh, yeah, yeah, just yeah, pretending. Yeah, no, no, wait, this is a rental. Oh, yeah. ah, no, 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 no. Don't worry, I, little puffling. We're going to throw you out to see where you'll be safe. Yeah, out to yeah. sea. No, no, I... My mommy said there would be days like this. Hi, Elmo. 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 Hi, Elmo.
He's almost friends. <laughs> and my pet rock, Rocco, is my friend. <laughs> Bye, Elmo. But, but Zoe, Rocco's a rock. <laughs> Dorothy's been thinking about friends, too. And look, look, look. She's got a friend over to play. <laughs> What's that, Dorothy? Huh? Oh, okay, okay. Dorothy has a question. How do you take turns with a friend? Oh, good question, Dorothy. Let's ask Mr. Noodle. Mr. Noodle! Mm -hmm. oh, oh, Shane, mm -hmm. be a cow and grow up, please. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was very friendly, Shane. <laughs> oh. oh, hi, Mr. Noodle. Hi. <laughs> Dorothy has a question. How do you take turns with a friend, Mr. Noodle? Yeah, Mr. <laughs> Noodle. How do you take turns? <laughs> Who's he calling? Who is it? It's Mr. Noodle's sister, Miss Noodle. Hi. Oh, I know her. <laughs> Mr. Noodle. <laughs> She's your sister and your friend. <laughs> so how do you take turns with a friend? <laughs> wow, look at that. So take turns with a swing. No, no, not like that. Take turns, Mr. Noodle and Miss Noodle. Yeah, take turns. Mr. Noodle? Miss Noodle? <laughs> That's not taking turns. Come here, please. Try again. Take turns on the swing. Just one person, <laughs> then the other. One person. <laughs> now they got it. <laughs> he cleaned it off for her. That's a good friend. <laughs> Very nothing. <laughs> no way. <laughs> you okay, Miss Noodle? Well, sharing is nice, but it's not taking turns. Miss Noodle, Mr. Noodle, come here again. Taking turns is when one person swings and the other person waits or pushes. <laughs> you got it now? Yeah. Try again. Get the swing. Got it. Now take turns. You can do it. Miss Noodle. Oh, uh, that's it. Miss Noodle is taking a turn. Yay! That's the way. Okay, Miss Noodle's turn. You push, Miss Noodle. Yay! Yeah. You got it. That's taking turns. Oh, Miss Noodle again. <laughs> she got her own stuff. <laughs> Boy, those noodles are real swingers. <laughs> What's that, Dorothy? Oh, okay. Dorothy wants to ask someone else. How do you take turns with a friend? Hi, Dorothy. This is how me and my friend Aslan take turns holding my pet rabbit. It's my turn now. Now it's your turn, Asan. Watch us take turns with these binoculars, Darkty. Look, a butterfly. Now it's my turn, Darkty. Yeah, a butterfly. Oh, thanks, everybody. Oh, and thanks, Dorothy. Now, Elmo will ask a baby. <laughs> wow, two babies. 
a baby and her baby friend. Oh, baby, how do you take turns with your friend? <laughs> oh, thank you, baby. Oh, and thank you too, baby. <laughs> oh, boy, those babies. <laughs> oh, and now... My friend Rocco and I take turns. Watch. My turn, Rocco. Vroom, vroom. Boy. <laughs> and now it's your turn, Rocco. Vroom, vroom. <sighs> oh, good one. Yeah. Bye, Elmo. But, but Zoe, <laughs> it's just a rock. Oh, boy. Where was Elmo? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And now Elmo has a question for uh, 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 you. Yeah, yeah. How many friends can fit on this boat? Let's count them and see. All aboard! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine! Wow! Nine friends! They fit on the boat and one can go round! Friend? Elmo wonders who else can be a friend. I'll draw. <laughs> oh, 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 <laughs> Everybody's so friendly today. Can draw be a friend? <laughs> can a birthday cake be a friend? No. But you can eat a birthday cake with your friends. Can a balloon be a friend? No. But you can give a balloon to a friend. Can a firefighter be a friend? Yes! Can a plant be a friend? Sometimes, maybe. Especially if it's thinking. I'm a friend? Isn't that lovely? <sighs> <laughs> Oh, thank you, Joy. And now... Elmo has bail. Oh, Elmo has bail. Oh, yay, Elmo, Elmo has, has bail. bail. Elmo has bail. Elmo has bail. Elmo has bail. Computer's friendly today, Elmo too. Elmo has bail. User friendly. Elmo has bail. <laughs> oh, boy. Elmo's got email from his friends, Snappy and Big Bird. Hi, Elmo. <laughs> Hi, Elmo. Bird and I are best friends. Yeah. We really care about each we other. We sure do. <sighs> but do you know that sometimes friends can have arguments? Sure, oh. Snuffy and I argue sometimes. <laughs> no, we don't, Bird. We never argue. Oh, yes, we do, Snuffy. No, we don't, Bird. Yes, we do. Bird, no, we don't yes, argue. Yes, we do. We no, do. Bird, we don't, Bird, no. We're arguing right now. We are? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right, Bird. Yeah, <laughs> and we're still friends. <laughs> friends to the end, buddy of mine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, let's say goodbye to Elmo. Okay, Bird, but you go first. No, no, you go, old pal. Go uh, ahead. No, friend, no, I you. insist. No, 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 you, no. you go first, no. Bird. Birdie, well, wait no. a minute, mm -hmm. wait a minute. We can say goodbye together. Bird, that is just brilliant. <laughs> yeah. Bye, Bye, Elmo! <laughs> Thanks, computer! Elmo's friend, Rebecca, has another good friend she likes to play with. And she told Elmo all about it. My friend, Nicole, lives next door. And yesterday, she came over to play. First, we made some jewelry with beads. We both love crafts. Then we looked at a book about space. We both love space exploration. Then we got hungry. So we went inside for a snack. We both wanted a banana, but there was only one left. So we shared it. We both love bananas.
then we went to the library with my mom to return the books. I carried the books, and my friend Nicole opened the door. Here, catch! <laughs> then, after the library, we played catch. Daniel came over and asked if he could play with us. We said, sure. I had a great time playing with my friends. Wow! <laughs> Rebecca has great friends! Now, Elmo wants to learn even more about friends. How can we find out even more? <laughs> oh, yeah! We can watch the Friends channel on TV! <laughs> hey, 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 Kitty, where are you going? That's not being very friendly. Come back, Kitty. Come on. Oh. <laughs> oh, now that's friendly. Put it up on TV. Thank you. Welcome to the Friends Channel. This is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. And now the Friends Channel presents the Friend Lady. I love making friends. You want to make some new friends? Well, here's how you do it. Stick out your hand and say hello. Hello. You might meet someone just like you who's really great to know. Hello. Now, mind you, I love the friends I've got. But making a new one hits the spot. Hey. Hi, I love baseball. How about you? Wow, I don't believe this. I love baseball, too. Me too. How are you? What's new? Hey, how you doing? When I meet someone new, I feel like mooing. Moo! Even if you're kind of shy, don't worry, it's okay. Come on, reach out and shake a hand and make a friend today. Huh? Reach out your hand and say hello. You might meet someone just like you who's really great to know. It's wonderful to watch how friendships grow. When you stick out your hand and say, is it like friends? Coming up next on the Friends Channel, two great buddy movies. For me and my pal, followed by Chum and Chummer. Thanks, TV. Now, Elmo wants to learn even more about friends. But how? Oh. Oh. <laughs> hey, Elmo. Oh, hi, Zoe. You want to talk to a friend? Can talk to his friend Zoe. <laughs> no, I mean talk to Rocco. But, but Zoe is Elmo's friend, not Rocco. Mm, why not? Well, because it's a rock. Oh well, yeah, but but Elmo, you can have all different kinds of friends, including rocks. But but, but Zoe, <gasps> Elmo can look. What? Look 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 look. Rocco is imagining that Elmo is a rock. <gasps> Elmo doesn't believe this. <laughs> Hello, Elmo. Will Elmo be Elmo Rock's friend? But Elmo Rock is a rock, so we can still be friends. Stick out your hand and say hello. A rock singer. You might meet someone just like you who's really great to know. It's wonderful to watch how friendships grow. <laughs> when you stick out your hand and say, Isn't my like friend today? Stick out your hand and say hello. <laughs> Thanks, Rocco. Oh, boy. Doesn't Rocco have a great imagination? It's a rock. No. <laughs> Elmo loves friends. Oh, and so does Dorothy. That's why Dorothy wants us to sing the friend song. And so does Dorothy's friend. Oh, Rocco loves that song. Good. Oh, the friend song. I love the friend song. Then sing along. Friends. Hey, everybody. Friends, 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 fri
Okay, Slimy, I'll read to you. Just don't say please, okay? Yay! All right, little guy. Here we go. Chapter 453 in The Adventures of Trash Gordon. Yay! When we last left our hero, he was stranded once again on the planet Spaghetti, and he was about to be mushed by a massive, menacing meatball. Mush, 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 mush. Just mush. then, Trash thought of a helpful rhyme on Planet Spaghetti, all covered with cheese. To get rid of a meatball, you just have to sneeze. So our hero sneezed the meatball to a faraway galaxy. Trash, feeling saucy, proudly exclaimed. <laughs> Sesame Street has been brought to you today by the letter M and by the number four. Now, no more now, Slimy. That's all for now. It's time for you to get some shut-eye, little guy. We'll read some more trash tomorrow. Hey, are you still here? I told you. No more trash, Gordon, until tomorrow. Sesame Workshop, the nonprofit educational organization behind Sesame Street and so much more. Learn more at sesameworkshop.org. SesameStreet.com!